All right, so I've got this Dell laptop. It's a Latitude 7390. Where's the model number? There we go. I got this off Marketplace for about 350 bucks. I reckon they're about 1500 new. So I run all my lasers off of this. But I found that it had a slight bow in the keyboard. So when I was using it, I can see that there was a little bit of a bow here. I thought it was a bit strange, but I had a sneaking suspicion that it's probably the battery. And as you can see, when I took the bottom cover off, a massive gap appeared. So I did a bit of research online. Some people have had some good success by deflating the battery packs from its gas. I've successfully done these three here, one, two, three. I thought I'd leave this one on this side and make a video. So let's pop over to here. Now, probably a sewing needle would be ideal. I'm just using a razor blade. That's just got a bit of sticky residue on it, but it's reasonably sharp. I'm gonna deflate that last battery and then the cover's gonna go back on as good as new without any bowing. I have ordered a brand new battery. It's on its way, express post. But I just thought I'd give this a go and just see what happens. And I probably would've left it if I found it out earlier. So anyway, let's carefully cut away the black plastic from the main batteries. So all you want to do is expose the silver part of the battery on the edge is perfect we might just go up a tiny bit more on this one all right so now we've got our battery exposed yes i did cut my finger uh removing this blade from the Irwin holder because that stupid button didn't work nothing major actually i might have a check actually oh there you go not even bleeding, what's going on? All right, so, didn't cut me that bad after all. All right, so that's the battery. We've got some gas in there. Get your needle and just poke the smallest hole you can in the side. I think that's all we need. Maybe a tiny bit more. There we go, I felt that go through. And don't breathe this gas in. You can't smell it or uh, feel it, but I wouldn't get too close to it. I'm about two feet away. Now just massage that air out of that hole. And there we go. We've got completely degassed battery packs. Actually, there is a small bit of air left in this one. Just lift that tag up again. Come on, where are you? So you just be extremely cautious. I wouldn't recommend actually doing this. Oh, there you go, that hole's covered up. Let's squeeze that gas out. Cover that hole back up with the tape. Oh, there we go. Bit of blood warning there. And now we we'll use our existing tape to go back over the hole so it doesn't vacuum in the gas again. So let's pop our cover back on and also grab yourself some tape and just cover up where you've peeled the existing tape off as well but let's see and that fits on beautifully once the screws are in no more gap no more bulge so there you go you can fix bulging lithium batteries so that's where, without screwing it in awesome and does it still work of course it does there we go i found some tape we're just going to cover up the little cuts we've made just make sure all that gas has completely dissipated looks pretty good but that will just ensure that we don't have any contamination. That's only plastic on the back anyway. Let's give that a bit of a clean. That looks pretty good. I might just blow that off a bit. 
Now let's put that cover back on. Put the screwdriver will screw him back up. One screw, two screws. One, two, three, four, five. One in the middle. Get in there. I think that is all of our screws done up. And that cover is fantastic. That's where our battery was bulging, so that would be the front of the laptop. That is absolutely magic. So there we go. No more mega bulging. Until a new battery arrives in a few days. Might even keep this one going. Beauty. And as always, thanks for watching. If you liked what you see, hit the like button. Don't forget to leave a comment below. That would help my channel grow. And if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to my channel. That would be fantastic.